Roberson party of two. Sarah, 2,591 days ago, we had the pleasure of meeting each other. I'm not 100% sure what you were thinking back then, but I remember thinking that you're an amazing girl and I wanted to become better friends with you. Over the following years, you amazed me with your gentleness towards others, your yearn for adventure, and how you are the hardest working person I know. Most of all, I watched you come to know our Savior, Jesus. I know that no man could find a more perfect person to spend the rest of his life with. From now until forever, I will love you more than anything else on earth. I will comfort you when you need and encourage you to continue growing into the woman God made you to be. I will lead our family as Christ leads his church, and as long as I'm breathing, I will never leave your side. I can't wait for all life has in store for us. Take my hand. Connor, I know that 16-year-old Sarah could not have imagined the impact your friendship would have in my life. So many days, moments, and people have contributed to this very moment coming to fruition. So today, I promise to always love you when it is fun and easy, and even more when it is not. You encourage me daily with your work ethic, patience, and loyalty. I will always laugh at your jokes, no matter how silly they may seem. Respect you as you lead our family and be your biggest cheerleader. Every once in a while, I'll let you win a game of Ticket to Ride. But I will always encourage you to achieve your loftiest of dreams. I am blessed to walk by your side on this path God has prepared for us. May kiss your bride. Okay, it is my honor for the very first time to announce to you Mr. and Mrs. Connor and Sarah Robertson.
not uncommon way, Connor celebrated his 21st birthday by having a few drinks with his friends in our apartment. Drinking it tends to reveal something about one's inner thoughts, something about their genuine self. So as the night was going on, Sarah was, she wasn't there, but she was worried about him, so she kept calling Connor to check in on him, see how he was doing. And every time his phone would ring, Connor, he would look at it, and he would loudly exclaim with great excitement, Oh, Sarah is calling me. I have the most beautiful girlfriend in the world. And he was always so happy to be talking to her on the phone. So, it seems clear to me, Connor is genuine. He's genuinely committed to Sarah, and I have no doubts of his love for her. I propose a toast. May God be your shared joy and the source of blessings in your marriage and life together. May you honor and love each other with full devotion and passionate hearts, always. <laughs>